I think I was driving somewhere, maybe driving someone somewhere, and <laughs> I think it was a woman that drove next to me, driving in her car. And I think she was playing music loud enough to where I could hear. I was listening. And it seemed very senseless. It seemed like, you know, if you were to take out your brain and leave it home, like music like that, like it's like you tie up your brain and do something to it to where you can't really think. I think I am not trying to be insulting, but music like that, like, how is that even entertainment? Talking about, I forget exactly what it was talking about, but somewhere around the lines of what that person has, and I think some sexual stuff, like, is that even music? Listen, I listen to things pertaining to God. Why? Because I feel the more I learn about God, the more I can place it in action and the better my life. So if I were to what? If I were to listen to music primarily speaking about sex and drugs and how fly I am, how I turn up or how I should turn up and juvenile stuff like that, won't that affect my behavior? If I choose to go around people who speak very vile, speaking about what they did to their girlfriend, wife. If I go around people speaking in a horrible way about men and women, won't that affect me? I think some people, oh man, I think some people may believe they are so tough, like words can't affect them. I think works, I think words can affect us all. Please don't be deceived. Myself, look, I, I want to serve God. I want to live for God. But if I choose to listen to the wrong stuff or the wrong people, and if I am not careful, I believe it is going to affect me. Listening to trashy songs, I don't know how you can even... Back in my past, I used to be entertained by stuff like that. But when I listen to it now, there was actually, there was a song that had a nice beat, but the words were extremely foul. But 
how can you be comfortable like with some of that music like how can you I think stuff like that dumbs you down make you more animalistic as a human I guess I can say If you are trying to live for God, stay away from that stuff. Stay away from it. There is no way I can listen to music like that and still have what I have in God now. If you understand what I am trying to say, I am talking about continually listening to mess like that because I think sooner or later I am going to adapt to it, right? I believe my way of life will change toward that way of thinking. So if you think about it, I think many music artists are ministers as well. A person who speaks about God, I guess you could say, hey, that person is a preacher, minister, pastor. Okay, what are they doing? They are talking, right? They are talking about things of God. Okay, what about these bad music artists? Aren't they ministers as well? Aren't they teaching you how to be? I guess very mindless, like operating on a very low level, morally, a very low moral level. I was texted by a person in my past. I am not trying to make myself seem very like like I have been good all my life or like I never have done any bad in my life. In my past, I did very bad things. I was taxed by someone and like it was a very vile text. Like, I think, like the nastiest way, I guess a person can text you, like in an insulting way, like saying words, just very, like to be able to even think of words to text a person like that, I think, your mind have to be really, really messed up. Like, how can you even... If I were to insult someone, like, it probably would not be really strong because my mind is primarily on things of God. But the way that man texted me, like, I believe his intent was to really, really insult me. Like... I did not read the whole text, but what I did read, like, I think there is a spirit to how we behave. When you see people acting really vile, really nasty, really foul, I believe that is a spirit. We have to be careful with what we entertain ourselves with. This is one of the reasons I listen to things of God so much. There is, I have an old iPod and I have an audio book of the Bible on it. And I enjoy it so much. I like listening to, um, 
well, with that dramatized audio of the Bible. I like it so much, man. And I try to keep my mind on the things of God, on God's rules and how I should behave toward people, reaping and sowing, because if I get angry or if I am having a tough time, I think much of the time my mind goes to what does the Bible say? The Bible say you have to do this. I don't do everything correctly, but I like my mind to be on good stuff. But if you are listening to mess and going around people talking about mess, won't mess be in you? Won't it be more difficult for you to serve God? Stop listening to this bad music. Seriously. It's senseless. I think a lot of it is senseless. You know, get like me. I have a nice car and and I'm looking down on people because I'm better than they. I think a lot of this music, I think many people, how can I say this? Whether they are rich or not, I think a lot of these bad music artists have self-esteem problems. And I, th and I think it is teaching other people to have self-esteem problems too. Let me stop here. God bless you.